Yo, what's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can log in into your UPSRS account. So I might be saying it a bit wrong, but UPSR is basically a staff account for UPS. So UPS is an international shipping country, so you can ship your stuff from one country to another using UPS. And UPSRS means the login portal for like the worker of UPS. If you guys are the staff of UPS, you want to go to UPSERSS.online. This is going to be the official website for UPS worker. If you guys are a customer, you want to go to UPS.com. All right. So this video is for staff of UPS. So follow the step if you're a staff of UPS. And before moving forward, if you guys are new to our channel one to step, then don't forget to hit that like and subscribe to our YouTube channel with notification on so you guys can get notified for our future video. Let's move on. First step, you want to search for UPSERS login. After you search for it, you want to click on where it says UPSERS UPS employee login. Don't click on the first option, it's going to take you to the regular UPS account. You want to go on the second one, which says UPSERSS.online. Click on it and it's going to take you to the login portal of this page. Once you're over here, scroll a bit down and it says visit the official website UPSRS. Click on it and close this ad. Just close this ad now. Now, once you close this ad, it should take you to the login portal. Now, once you're in UPSERS.com, you're at its official website, all right? Now, once you're over here, you can click on login. You can also just straight up go to UPSERS.com. It's going to straight up bring you that page, all right? Now, once you're over here, you need to enter your employee number in order to sign in. Now, once you enter your employee number, at the end, make sure you write at UPS.com, all right? So, as you guys can see, it even says over here, enter your employee number. Then, you have to add a add ups.com so let's say my employee number is one two three four five i add this and then i do add ups.com all right once you do that click on next and on the next step it's going to ask you for the password of your account once you enter the password of your account basically if the password enter is correct you should be able to log in into your UPSERS account all right and if you can't access your account for some reason you can click on can't access your account in order to recover your account as well so yeah that's how you guys can log in into your UPSERS account so if you guys found our video helpful don't forget to hit the like and subscribe to our channel once a step. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.